if you're watching this video chances are that you might be preparing for utm in 2025 and you're also taking chemistry as a subject my name is inok akiemi you can call me to the inok i got a 96 over 100 in my utm chemistry and i also have a three years experience in teaching o-level chemistry so i feel like i'm in the right position to tell you how to cover your chemistry syllabus in just two months in this video we're going to be talking about the eight week plan why it will work how you can do it even though you feel like you don't know how and possible challenges you might face and how to overcome them all right so this is a eight week plan for you to cover the whole of chemistry syllabus in two months so you can see in the week one we have the basics of chemistry the fundamental chemistry week one we have the fundamentals of chemistry this is where we have introduction to chemistry matter separation techniques then day two we have element compounds and make sure you're going to learn the basis of what is an element what is a compound what is a mixture what are impurities you know so for with day three chemical laws the law of conservation of matter by anthony lavoisa law of definite proportion by joseph proust you know and others so before you should learn the basis of atomic structure protons neutrons and electrons you can just use a summary note for that now for week two um we have chemical bonding and state of matter this is still basics of chemistry we talk, talk about what is a bond why do atoms go and bond you learn that atoms bond in order to attain stability uh, you're going to learn the types of bond we have ionic covalent um intermolecular interatomic kind of bond you can cross yourself a lot in this topic so i'm also going to add the syllabus the jump syllabus to the google link to the google drive the link to the google drive i'll be sending so i'll be pasting in the description below so do well to check everything out to help you so and we have it like that like that like that like that so you do well to check it out and see it for yourself it's not so complex so the final week um which is because is for intensive revision and thinking of more questions so you have to have like a plan for your reading like an everyday plan for your reading knowing that you are very weak at chemistry that means you almost have to read chemistry every day so you have to have a, a, a plan for your studying at least if you studied about four hours to six hours with this plan at least you have to study chemistry well and also your other subjects well so this is the eight week plan and i believe that if you do well to go through it and do everything under it you would really get it um, efficiently and effectively so let me know how it goes on your end how be anticipating your reply okay so past questions are very important and they are made available not for you to expect the same questions in your exam but for you to understand as i said earlier what the examiner expects of you to know so i would advise you to use the jam remix chemistry past question and also you can also use the past questions behind your textbook especially textbooks like laminar and explicit chemistry I mean, some groups can be very very helpful especially if you have a partner that is willing to do the same challenge with you that is completing the whole of the chemistry syllabus in two months one thing you should try to avoid in brainstorming groups is that if you notice the brainstorming group, group is becoming more of an intimidating group rather than a brainstorming group do well to leave that brainstorming group because a brainstorming group should foster learning and not intimidation so my next advice to you is the use of ai so ai can actually be used to help your learning and one way i personally use ai is okay i said okay chat dpt explain this thing like you would to a 10 year old and it will explain it to me in a way that even one of the best teachers I've ever had will not think of explaining that. The next step is to join the community. I, in 2023, I created a community called the Chemistry Clinic. My aim was to help students see chemistry as something that is not so difficult and something that can actually be a walkover. We post daily chemistry questions and we also host free and paid classes on topics like organic chemistry, metals and compound, and even stoichiometry. So do well to join our community. I'll put the link in the description. Yeah, how would this plan work? This plan will work if you dedicate yourself to it, if you put yourself to it and apply yourself to it. Why would this plan work? This plan would work because we are going to be making use of the most high yield material that's use of videos, use of summary notes, use of past questions, brainstorming in just the space of these two months there are some possible challenges that you can actually face for these topics like organic chemistry stoichiometry you can make use of videos and also you can probably make someone to put you through the topics also so if you miss any study day you should try to in your time to be like i said earlier make sunday or a particular day of the week um a day where you do much of not stretch hours of studying so that you can cover up or miss classes or for classes that you have missed in the course of the week okay so retaining everything in two months i know it's going to be quite overwhelming but there's something called active or space recall so you should try to practice active or space recall and that's where brainstorming group comes in where your own personal effort comes in trying to even recall what you studied while you are doing other tasks like your chores or 
going about your daily activities and lastly for the student with very very poor background so you might want to watch my next video on high yield topics that you should focus on if you still want to get about an 80 or higher than a 75 in your etm in chemistry okay so my final note chemistry sometimes can be quite challenging and may actually look very abstract so it's i totally understand this but if you can put your mind to it and you can be very very much open-minded i believe that it's just going to be a stepping stone if you find this video very helpful do well to share to your friends and also give this video a like you're also helping it to reach more people that may need this video thank you so much for watching